right, this is a walk around video and test drive of our 04 Dodge Ram 2500. It's got the 5.9 Cummins diesel engine in it. It's the common rail, so it's a 04 and a half, which everyone wants for the smoother idle. Better fuel mileage. And this truck right here was originally a California truck. As you can see, rockers, no rust anywhere on them. Bed sides, zero rust, nothing starting, no bubbles. Thing along those lines. This one's got a nice 35 inch BF Goodrich all terrain tires on it. Something you always want to look at when you're buying a used diesel truck is to make sure it has a muffler on it because a lot of places they just bypass that and pass it on inspection. Every one of our trucks has a muffler so it'll pass inspection whenever you need it to. This one has uh, airbags added on it for towing. The Oh, fifth wheel hitch. There's a little ding right here. Nothing major. So it's in really, really good shape for its age. No rust or any bubbling starting on this wheel well. This one's got a fast fuel system recently installed on it. Keeps those injectors living a lot longer, having extra filters on it. As you can see, no rust. It's actually got a nice bed liner installed, spray bed liner. A little bit of wear on the paint, but as you can see, it's not rusting or anything like that. Cold start on this one. These driver's seat cushions are always busted down and broken where they don't feel good and it feels like you're sitting on a rail. As you can see this one's not worn at all. Plenty of, plenty of life in that. No tears or rips or anything like that in it. It's got a aftermarket radio in it. Everything works great with that. It's got overhead display
Of course, all the power windows and locks and everything like that work. Kick on this air conditioning. This right here is a Carfax report on the truck. Shows it's a four owner truck, which actually a three owner truck is one and two are the same owner. Three owner truck, really. It's had zero accidents, zero reported damage, 12 service history records. It shows the last abdominal reading. Make sure you always ask your dealer for a Carfax on it. Always shows you everything with maintenance and how it was taken care of. You can see it was never had any odometer rollbacks or anything like that. This one's actually had a decent amount of service history. Eighty service service at a dealer. Ninety-two. The previous owner, he uh, he had just got injectors replaced on it, the fast fuel system replaced on it, and a brand new transmission. So you don't have anything to worry about on this type of truck. easily. everything on this when it comes to ball joints, tie rod ends, pitman arm, anything it needed is replaced. We have paperwork to show that. I know a lot of dealers, they just grab trucks and they'll toss them right on the lot after they pick one up and say they're good to go. We go through ours more than anybody and all of our stuff is perfect when it hits a lot mechanically. It needs nothing. Otherwise, we wouldn't put it out there. This one received all new ball joints and, and everything. I'll go over the receipt here for it. And everything we did did in just a second. He's blowing nice and cold, by the way.
shape there's no wear or tear or anything like that on it no discoloration anything like that nine times out of ten these things are torn or not in good shape or discolored or loose feeling this nothing it's perfect leather steering wheel This right here is the title, showing it's a good title, lean release. We've got Missouri State inspection with it also. nine trucks they're they're awesome and reliable everyone likes these things This is Missouri safety inspection done by Valvoline. We have every one of our vehicles done with this where they go over it and verify everything's nice and tight on it and everything's safe to drive down the road. That was the title. This is some of the maintenance that we did on it. We did a lot of uh, OEM parts here. Uh, these crankcase breathers that a lot of people don't replace on them. Uh, it's really good for them, just makes them run a little bit better. We placed those on all of our rams. As you can see, we put a lot of labor into our stuff. It's 
the inspection report. And here is a list of some of the maintenance that we did on this. This is just normal stuff before we put it on our lot. Every single one of our trucks gets looked over and checked over extremely well. And if they have any play in anything, we just go ahead and replace it all. So, this one received a valve cover gasket, a axle pinion seal, as you can see upper and lower ball joints, sway bar links, tie rod ends, track bar, adjusting sleeves, Mopar oil filter, Rotella oil, because that's the best oil for the diesels. Um, got Moog, good U-joints in it, and uh, tie rod ends. So as you can see, anyone that just puts these rams out there on their lot, always ask them to see what they did to them because almost every single one of these needs front end work because they're just common for the ball joints. So we do it, made sure it's all done for you. Good to go there. Um, other than that, that about sums it up for this truck. Go ahead and put it in the park and get out and show you that there's no leaks underneath it. Anything of that sort after doing a nice little drive. As you can see, it's been sitting here for a little bit now at idle. And uh, nothing dripping or leaking. So, if you're interested in this, give us a call.